Welcome curious minds to a journey into the heart of the wild, where nature's drama unfolds in the most chilling and perplexing ways. Today, we venture into a realm where life and death are intertwined, where survival sometimes means resorting to the unthinkable. Cannibalism The natural world is a stage, and its actors are as diverse as the ecosystems they inhabit. But amidst the breathtaking beauty and harmonious rhythms, there exists a harsh reality. A stark reminder that nature's tapestry is woven not only with threads of cooperation and symbiosis, but also with threads of brutality. In this exploration, we invite you to step into this theater of survival, where evolution has written its most gripping tales. It's a world where predator and prey engage in ruthless battles, where mothers sometimes turn on their own offspring, and where even the act of mating can be fraught with peril. Join us as we unravel stories of resilience, adaptation, and, yes, the darker side of nature. These are not tales for the faint of heart, but they are essential narratives that illuminate the extraordinary lengths to which creatures will go in their quest for life. Our journey begins with one of the most iconic examples of cannibalism in the insect world, the praying mantis. Here, the female, while seemingly ruthless, has a profound reason behind her actions. The act of cannibalism by the female praying mantis provides her with essential nutrients, particularly proteins, that are vital for producing eggs. This behavior may appear cruel, but it's a survival strategy, ensuring that her offspring have the best possible chance in life. Evolutionally, it's a fascinating adaptation. Now, let's turn our attention to another well-known example, the Black Widow Spider. Known for its venomous bite and distinctive appearance, the female Black Widow's behavior often raises eyebrows. After mating, some female Black Widows may cannibalize their mate, starting with his head. This act can provide the female with a significant nutritional boost, aiding in her ability to reproduce. While it may seem harsh, it's a survival tactic that benefits her and her future offspring. Moving on to a different realm of the animal kingdom, we encounter hamsters. Surprisingly, these furry creatures, often kept as pets, can exhibit cannibalistic behavior under specific circumstances. Stress or disturbances can lead to mother hamsters eating their own young. This behavior serves as a grim reminder of the complexities of nature, even in seemingly gentle creatures. Now, let's delve into the world of primates, where the lines between human and animal behaviors sometimes blur. Chimpanzees, among other primates, have been observed engaging in acts of cannibalism. These behaviors often stem from territorial disputes or infanticide. While difficult to witness, these actions play a role in the intricate social dynamics of primate communities and may serve as a strategy for survival and dominance. Our final stop takes us to the intriguing world of Komodo dragons, the largest lizards on Earth. These formidable creatures, while known for their predatory prowess, sometimes turn to cannibalism, especially in their younger years. It's a stark reminder that even in the reptilian realm, the struggle for resources and dominance can lead to acts that may appear cruel to human observers. In conclusion, the examples we've explored today shed light on the complexities of nature. While cannibalism may seem cruel from a human perspective, it plays a vital role in the survival and evolution of various species. If you found this journey through the world of cannibalism in nature as fascinating as we did, Please consider supporting our channel by liking this video and subscribing for more captivating explorations of the natural world. We'd love to hear your thoughts and questions, so please share them in the comments below. Thank you for joining us on this educational and eye-opening adventure into the wild side of nature. Until next time.